Next week, it seems as though Claudia isn't getting the message, and after Justin receives a further call he decides it's time to call it quits. Justin believes it's the last time he has to help Claudia. However, Justin doesn't realize that Claudia is luring him to a remote cabin in what looks to be an attempt to seduce him. When Claudia makes her move and attempts to kiss Justin, he is quick to knock her back, which doesn't please her. Retaliation, Claudia takes his car keys and throws them into the bushland, leaving him stranded at the cabin with no phone signal. Justin feels stunned and stupid, James continued. It's like he's been treated like a fool. Meanwhile, Leah has started becoming suspicious of all the time Justin has been spending away from the garage, and after a bit of detective work she goes to see Claudia's husband Eric. Eric explains to Leah that Claudia has a history of going after other men for affairs. At first, Leah is sure Justin would never cheat, Ada added. But once she meets up with Claudia's, ex, husband, she starts having doubts. Justin is desperate to let Leah know what is going on but it takes a long time for him to track down a phone signal, by which point Leah has worked herself up into thinking something is definitely going on between the pair. With all of Justin's dishonesty, and the claims about Claudia's history with men, Leah tells Justin to not bother coming home, as she won't be there. Will Justin be able to make it back to Summer Bay to put Leah straight?